Hello. Hey, girl. <laughs> Hold on. Okay. Hi. I see you. Hi. How are you? Good. Like you. Good. How are you? Good. I'm having one of those moments where I just like only open the Zoom to find out that I'm having a really bad hair day. <laughs> oh no. No, it looks great. It looks no, great. it's fine. You know how it is. How's it going? Good. Nashville. I some friends behind you. <laughs> oh yeah. Yes. They're always there. Always watching. Yeah. Does ever feel like somebody's always watching you? One of those things. Yep, they are. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm excited because my coworkers that have been at the buzz for a really long time, they've all met you. They've always said like really good things about you. And I'm like, it's my turn now. <laughs> it's my That's turn. That's awesome. It's been a while. I live in Nashville now. Um, and I listen to the buzz. So I'm like, awesome. I'm actually maybe going to be on the radio. Like yeah. I could actually hear it like old times. It's always just all, you know, internet and everything now. Yeah, exactly. Do you still get that moment? Like if you hear a song on the radio, it's like, oh, that's me. Yeah, totally. It's yeah. fun when it ha yeah. happens in like an awkward public space. Yeah. So Liz I don't know. The same thing. Like, She's like, I'll be in an Uber and hear my song and she'll start like geeking out. And I'm like, oh, that's cool. <laughs> like, they love this song. Uh, yeah, exactly. Like, uh, it's, it's, it'll be in, uh, um, oh, what store always happens? I guess it's just the, either the grocery store or um somewhere else world of uh, bring me to life or my immortal obviously um yeah. the oldies it's so funny because i'm like nope put my hair back tying it up right and stick kind of too <laughs> well it's a big week we're so excited and i admit that it sucked keeping this a secret as long as we did because when you announce know. the tour people are like oh no nashville dates and we're like i know <laughs> all my friends too they're like you're not gonna do nashville I'm like yeah i am I just just wait yeah just hang on have to yeah, exactly. But we're so excited and a venue yeah. like Bridgestone, that's huge. So we're really yeah. looking forward to it. We're excited too. We really are. Oh my God. It's been forever. It's been since 2019, since we got up and played a real show in front of a real crowd. So we're dying for it. Yeah. That's what I was going to ask you this. So you haven't done any show since this is going to be your first round. Yeah. I mean, we did a live stream, but it just doesn't count. Like no. not without the crowd. So, um, yeah, this is the first, this is going to be our first time playing, you know, real shows with the, the new album. And we're just like, so we love the new album. I mean, obviously we made it, but like, we really love it. Like on a deep level, like it pulled us through a dark time and, um, that next unfinished piece is just playing it, you know, getting to, to live inside it and experience it at the show with fans. We can't yeah. wait. That's something that I noticed about your new album is I'm like, it gives me that attitude. Like I got something to say. Yeah. I'm <laughs> yeah. looking forward to hearing that live. Well, it, you know, when it's been like 10 years, you better have something to say. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so pent up it, rage. Right. <laughs> do you think it's going to be like weird getting back out there? Or do you think you're just going to pick up right where you left off? We've had big, you know, gaps before, um, you know, between album cycles and touring cycles. And I've definitely the biggest one I think was when I became a mom. Um, my son's seven now. And I remember, you know, going into a new chapter, getting pregnant, like having a child and just being in a different headspace, like that first um, year after he was with us and just being in, it's just, it was really hard for me to really feel like I'm going to step on there on that stage and it's just going to be powerful and I'm going to feel powerful and I'm going to feel young and the boots are going to fit and everything's going to like, you know, go right. I was nervous, but it's funny how it works. It is, if it's in you, it's in you forever. I stepped on stage and I remember like two seconds in, it was just like, I wasn't even thinking anymore. It's like, it's just, it's just like that thing takes over and it's coming from the inside. It felt so beautiful to know that like, okay, I'm totally not done yet. Um, so yeah, there's always nerves at first, no matter what, especially when there's anything new going on, even if we're playing one new song, like we're always nervous, like I'm going to mess it up. I'm going to mess it up. Um, so this is going to be a whole, whole new set really. Um, so there's a lot for us to be like, you know, anxious and nervous about a little bit but you get past the first couple of days and you get the rock neck going on and, and you get where your body's comfortable and your brain starts being more comfortable and it starts to be really fun yeah exactly and I know this isn't the first time that you've done something with Hailstorm but we are so excited that it's I know two amazing bands on stage yeah we love them I love Lizzie and we love um watching each other play and we love singing together so we'll definitely find a place 
um, somewhere in the set. We haven't quite figured out what we're going to do yet, but we'll do something where we come together in the show. Yeah. That's what I was going to ask you. I'm like, can you give us any insight of like what we can expect? It's hard to decide what to do, you know, because <laughs> I don't know. I'm, I think there might be like two little opportunities to do something. So sure. we'll just have to be surprised. Yeah. So since you live in Nashville, like, have you established like your go-to places yet? I haven't been going out, you know, I mean, with sure, everything yeah. that's been going on, it's hard. I mean, us. like we're, it's just hard. It's hard to ever feel like totally like, okay, it's not okay. And the weather is beautiful right now. So we still, you know, if there's ever an opportunity to like sit outside and like have dinner or something, I'm, I'm in, um, I'm trying to think, where's my place? I haven't been out. I honestly, I hurt myself really bad last week. <laughs> I finally started, here's what happened. I, fi I hate working out. I hate it. I don't know about you, but I hate it so much. And I have okay. to find something that engages my mind. Um, and music helps, but I finally found the thing for this time around. I have to always like go through like some kind of training before we go back on tour to get my body strong. Um, and I have found all these beautiful um, hiking trails in uh, one of the state parks near here. So I've been hiking around um, Percy Warner um, on all these trails and I like run down all the different little paths, not like the main drag. Um, and it's super fun because I don't know how long it's going to be or when it's going to end. So I can't quit, you know, and I'm listening to the set list and getting excited and going fast. And I tripped. <gasps> or took a bad step in the middle of the forest by myself and twisted my ankle. Look at this boot. Look at my boot. What? Oh my God. I know. So I've been just like, honestly, like depressed the past <gasps> week laying around with my foot up playing. I started a new Animal Crossing Island. It's just like, we're done. <laughs> Oh my um, God. I know I was starting to feel really good. And then it's like, no, you're not. Um, it's fine. It's doing better, but, uh, yeah, I no good. I I'm going to get back to it, but it's hard when you find that thing that you finally are like, this is good for me. This is a healthy choice. I'm actually enjoying it. And then it doesn't work out. It's like, great. Why, am I trying? Why do I even get up in the morning? I don't know. <laughs> I know. It's like, okay. New, like, I don't like exercising either. I'm like, okay, that just motivates me to keep not exercising, yeah. I guess. No, well, the good thing is it's made my husband start cooking like more, like more than he ever really has. And he's good at it. And I'm like, this is great. We're going to do this more. Like, you're good. You're going to be I good. I might feel that idea. <laughs> Maybe if I do that to my leg, my fiance will start cooking See? and cleaning more. There's Thanks always an upside. That. I'll let you know what happens. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> don't do it. I don't recommend it. Yeah. <laughs> well, we are so excited to see you. I mean, I'm happy to see you now and finally meet you in kind of person. Um, Me too. December 3rd at Bridgestone Arena with Hailstorm, Lilith Czar. And yeah, we, we can't wait to see you soon. We can't either. We're so excited. Um, thanks for having me. Yeah. And uh, stay cool. Stay safe. Yeah. Take care of that leg. All right. Thank you. See you around. <laughs> see ya. Bye, Haley.